people I recognize think, me, I but I don't think that's true. Nah, they do. They true. do. I give myself a hard time, but I'm not really. I try to like. I'm like more low key. I'm not like a caricature with it. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're trying to be cool about it. Like when I walk around with the other guys and shit, I'm so embarrassed. Because they're like, yo, yo, it's the situation. Literally, like- situation has a T-shirt that says, "I'm a, sit- I'm the situation." Paulie, like he just walks around full blowout. I'm like, holy shit. I you know? DM'd Polly when I was in college, and he DM'd me back, and I was very excited about it. What'd you say? I, I wasn't a slut because I'm mm. not, never have been. But I, I DM'd him and I said, if I paid you ten thousand dollars, would you DJ my birthday party? Okay. That's all I asked, and then he wrote back and said, girl, I would DJ for free, and oh, then never yeah. said anything again. Wow, <laughs> was that a real offer? Because uh, you didn't have ten thousand dollars. I was lying going to around. collect because uh, oh, I told go, you me oh, and all go my go friends love the me? show, and I was yeah. like, we can collect ten thousand and get him to come DJ. Yeah. At one of the shows, I had an idea for a fun thing. Nice. Yeah, he does Soon. that a lot. He does like he does college campuses like where he just makes so well, much money. Well, he owes me one. Tell tell me, fucking owes Kimmy me one. Kimmy Kong, dude. I've been waiting for my free DJ mm-hmm. this whole time. You promised me. I showed all my friends, yeah. and I was like, "It's gonna happen." And then no. that was it. He's DJing like festivals and shit. I'm like doing stand up in front of eight Norwegians <laughs> in Greenwich, and Greenwich Village Comedy Club <laughs> and being a stripper. <laughs> nah, the stripper shit paid man money, dude. I mean, honestly, a stripper does not sound like a bad job. It wasn't a real stripper. Like no, Chippendales. It's a performance art almost. It's like an off Broadway play, and they and they hire people with like names like z-list celebrities to go like headline for like the month right 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 it was super fun fuck it's like you and christina aguilera grinding on each other and shit she's not a z-list she's no. huge is she, is she still i mean not still but she's like a legend i, <laughs> I don't think she would like she's set she's like the people that are doing that it, okay <laughs> the people that are doing that like you know like obviously times are tough like if they were older people that have mm-hmm. to like do like the surreal life or something like that. Right. It's like, you know, that like the well kind of like dried up a little bit. And so it's funny with me. Depends on the commercials they're doing. You ever see the commercials else? they're doing. Um, was there an example of that? Oh, I don't know. Like, like the Shaq movie. doing the like. Well, Shaq, like, I think he like, invests in the companies. There are loopholes to this. And my, oh, see, dude. I was a loophole because everybody thought, because like when I would post Chippendales, the first like comment I would get would be like, ooh, times must be tough, huh? Oh. But I became a stripper at the peak of my career, top of my bank account, All right. because I was just doing it to be a whore. Fuck, dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, I wasn't like doing it for the money. I was doing it because like, I was just like, when you're on Jersey Shore, you kind of just only work like 30 days out of the year or something like that right and then the other time you have to like do appearances and whatever so that's why i did it but it was not because i was broke or anything like that no you no know? no. you did it for and I almost commented, the troll it seems like almost to troll uh, like I, it almost seems like an idea that everybody was like yeah right and you're like now nah, i'm gonna do it yeah well i laughed at it myself first and then i saw the offer and i was like okay like how much are we talking here? Like to slap on a bow tie and whatever. And then I went to go see the show and I was like, oh, this is like watching like a fucking comedy show. Yeah. Like this is not like yeah, a I heard male it's fun. I want to see it. Yeah, it's super fun. I want to bring my mom to it. You should. There's my mom. a lot of horny moms. My mom, mom came. She did? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Was she Was she excited or upset at first? No, she's so excited. I mean, my mother has seen me. That's not the worst thing she's seen right. me done. She grew up watching me on Jersey Shore. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, that's fucked up. Did you tell her not to watch the sex scenes or was... My mom's cool. Like you know, we're Italian. We're my my Wait, family's a bunch. Did you guys all of, watch it together? No, 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 okay. no, no, no. But my family's a bunch of like Italian degenerates that like are alcoholics and party every week. So the shit that I did was tame compared to what real people do at the Jersey Shore. Well, there was it makes no sense. there was no drugs. Well, Mike was doing drugs, but like we weren't doing drugs. We weren't like. Is that know. a known thing? Now it is. Yeah. That he was doing drugs. It wasn't at the time. It was like hidden, but like now he's like talks about it every fucking day because he like he wrote a book about it. I heard. Uh, I think I I get all my news from TikTok. Mm. By the way, all nice. of my news, all my facts. I heard on That's TikTok so accurate. That, that was one of the nicknames for Jim Tan Laundry was cocaine. Is that true? That Mike. Oh no! You mean oh, like the the like, laundry like he, meant like a line of laundry or no, something? No, actually, that's funny. No, actually, he would say um, he would call his boy on the duck phone, and he'd be like, "Yo, you bring quack quack! I need an eighth." No, no, he'd be like, "Yo, you <laughs> bring you bringing hot chicks tonight?" 
Hot oh. chicks was the code word. Hot chicks? Mm -hmm, That's mm -hmm. so funny. Hot chicks. Yeah, because he was too busy calling women females. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> like, we need something like different. <laughs> uh, he's like, let's do hot chicks for co uh, for coke and grenades yeah. for women. Yeah, the, like sluts, the opposite. Sluts for the real women. 